Recently, FX Home released HitFilm Express 2017, the latest version of HitFilm Express. Today, we'll be reviewing this program in full. HitFilm Express is a free video editing software for both Mac and PC. The HitFilm lineup aims to bridge the gap between video editing and visual effects, and puts both into one program. Think of it as both Adobe Premiere and After Effects in one program. The Express version of HitFilm is extremely powerful, but lacks some features available in the Pro version. You can also buy add-on packs to get specific features from Pro without having to pay all the money. There will be three parts to today's video, a positives list, a negatives list, and a comparison with other video editing programs. We'll also have a summary at the end. Let's begin. The first good thing about HitFilm Express 2017 is that it's free. It's not a trial or a dodgy crippled application, it's a robust proper application with amazing features all for free. HitFilm is both an editor and a compositor. This means that you can do both without switching programs. This is by far the biggest standout feature of HitFilm. Powerful visual effects. We'll go into this more detail of course, but one standout feature of HitFilm compared to other free software is its VFX capability, which most competitors reserve for their paid versions. Unlimited video and audio tracks. Stack up video on video, sound effect on sound effect, and you will never run out of tracks, as long as your computer can handle it. Advanced keyframing and animation. HitFilm Express has many advanced tools for animation, including creating keyframes, adjusting spatial and temporal interpolation for keyframes, and a value graph. This is an amazing set of animation tools for a free software. Motion tracking. HitFilm has advanced single and double point motion tracking, and it's very accurate. The tracks are high quality, and you can use them to attach objects to these points or stabilize your video. Mocha 3D tracking is also available, but for an extra purchase as an add-on pack from the HitFilm store. Over 370 effects. These effects include 3D effects such as fire and explosions, color grading tools such as levels histogram and curves, shake effects, light flares, color grade presets, and much, much more. A couple of the cool ones that might entice you to download the application are lightsaber effects with a two-point auto effect that does all the calculations for you, and fully 3D effects such as fire and explosions. These effects are the main reason why HitFilm is such an advanced compositor, even in the Express version. 4K. Something new about this version of Express is the ability to create timelines and export in 4K. Of course, you will need a good computer. Also, HitFilm is pretty intuitive. It's quite easy to learn and understand, and once you've got the hang of it, it's very easy to navigate the software, especially since it's both an editor and compositor in one. I'll leave a link to a beginner tutorial in the description. HitFilm is also very customizable. The whole interface can be changed up and all the keyboard shortcuts are now editable. Of course, you can always go back to defaults, and there are workspace presets too. RAM Preview Often an underrated feature of HitFilm, the RAM preview allows you to view parts of your composites in full resolution, properly rendered without having to export the whole thing. Export Queue HitFilm's Export Queue allows you to export multiple files, one after another, and it persists between closing the application. Now that's a lot of good things about HitFilm because, well, it is a really good application. HitFilm does come with its downsides too. Let's talk about some of the negative aspects of the software. HitFilm is slow. If your computer is below average, you'll have trouble running HitFilm properly. If you have a mid-ranged computer like I do, then HitFilm should run fine, but 4K will still be a no-go, and heavy visual effects will still take time to render. If you have an Intel GPU like me, then HitFilm will be running slower than if you have an Nvidia GPU. If you have a powerful computer, then HitFilm should run just fine. Also, HitFilm does occasionally crash. It's not very often, but it does happen sometimes. Don't worry though, if you haven't saved your project, then HitFilm will automatically recover it for you after it crashes. No full screen. Unlike applications like iMovie, HitFilm cannot play back video in full screen while you're editing. 
no 3D model import. There are 3D effects and 3D capabilities inside of HitFilm Express, but it is impossible to import 3D models into HitFilm with the Express version. This feature is reserved for Pro. Also, there are no color scopes in HitFilm Express. Not a deal breaking loss, but something to consider. Now we're going to compare it to some of its competitors, all of which are also free. The most obvious competitor is DaVinci Resolve Lite. It's the only free editing application that comes close to what HitFilm can do. There's also iMovie and Windows Movie Maker. Let's take a look at how HitFilm compares to DaVinci Resolve. Resolve has none of the super advanced visual effects that HitFilm offers. However, it is a great non-linear video editor that is also a very complete package. It focuses more on color grading rather than visual effects, as that was the program's original purpose. It has super advanced color grading tools that far surpass anything even the pro version of HitFilm can do. So if you're editing a short film that requires no visual effects, DaVinci Resolve may be the better option. Its editor is, in my opinion, a little bit cleaner than HitFilm's, and it doesn't lag quite as much as HitFilm's. 4K exporting is also available in DaVinci Resolve, which is why many people chose to use DaVinci over the previous version of Express. iMovie and Windows Movie Maker both pale in comparison to HitFilm and Resolve. They're simple and easy to use though, and iMovie has brilliant use of the Intel GPU inside Max, with the ability to edit 4K video on an i5 Mac like the one I own without lag. In my opinion, iMovie is a lot better than Windows Movie Maker, and even has basic keyframing and animation. You only really want to use these programs if you have a very basic project though. They work well on cheaper computers. And that's my full review of HitFilm Express 2017. It's a free video editing and visual effects application that is awesome at editing and even better at compositing. There's really not much else to say except that it's free. I'll leave links for you to check it out in the description below. There's no reason not to get it, so you may as well give it a shot. I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, be sure to leave a like, subscribe for more videos, and share this with your friends. I will see you in the next one. Stay shiny. Bye.